So the Valens Company is unique in its identity as we focus on being cannabis processors and commercialization experts. We are unique in the industry in that we can support all of our own brands and also help other cannabis LPs with processing, with R&D, and with bringing their products to market. So we're able to support from extraction and processing and produce products at bulk or move into full white label processes to support them. Within that, um, we also have our own brand identities, which are very exciting to put out to the market across all the provinces. And to really stay a step above, we need to make sure that we can meet all of the requirements for packaging, for excise stamp, for labeling within Health Canada to get it to market on time. And with that, equipment is really the backbone of it. The same thing for any other industry, to make sure it's reliable, to make sure we have consistent, repeatable results. And for that, it's taken us a long time to find the right partners. So we've worked with Waypack, the Paxium Group, in order to start taking CPG to the next level. Um, our initial purchase was on the Wanneroll, which is an automated pre-roll machine, and we've upgraded that to be able to produce pre-rolls at eight lanes at a time, producing up to 60 pre-rolls a minute that meet within our Health Canada tolerances. The Wanneroll has a unique identity in that it was able to really take in to light um, the background of food processing and what's required for that, what's required under good manufacturing and processing practices, in order to make sure we have stainless steel surfaces, that we have things that are clean and wipeable, that we have um, tooling that we can change out, where we have minor adjustments that can be made in line to get the best products. The scale options to go through for your accepts, rejects, um, having an integrated you know, HMI so you can see where those levels are at, so you can have the right reporting for batch records, so you can have an all-encompassed look into what pre-roll production is. The high speeds of the equipment is a critical piece of it. However, I would say the most important piece in this industry, especially in Canada, is the consistent quality and weights. Um, it's a very tricky piece to get dialed down at scale. And if we don't meet those targets, we're not within what we need for Health Canada. And also, you have unhappy customers. So it's really coming to meet quality and speed, which isn't that often you can find the right piece. We worked on site for about a week across our three different shifts that we have to get to know the equipment, to figure out the little intricacies, to understand the micro adjustments and to really understand the finesse it takes to run the best way we can. One of the interesting pieces when we talk about the comparables between different pre-roll equipment is you have the rotary design that's quite common uh, to something that's different like the water roll that has more of that linear design. So you have at this eight channels that you can have working at the same time. The Wanna Roll helps take us to the next level of being a showpiece to show consistency and speed in manufacturing. We are very excited um, to start looking at the Swifty Bagger and the different equipment and how we scale up to meet that demand and to have our consistency and quality and product across the board, just like we have with our pre-rolls from the Wanna Roll. We would like to take you into our Wanna Roll room to see where the magic happens for all our pre-rolls. At the machine level, we can see the big difference uh, that we discussed, which is the difference between a rotary piece of equipment and a linear piece of equipment. Allowing for the eight channels of operation in a linear direction, we're able to produce eight pre-rolls at a time with the same compaction, same consistency, moving through to get your accurate twits and cut to come out to our end for our accepts and rejects. The difference between this and a rotary piece of equipment is a rotary piece of equipment may have eight lanes for the tooling, but it's doing each pre-roll run at a time. So you aren't able to get the same speed and you aren't able to get the same consistencies. We've seen a lot of rins with getting the water roll going. And so we needed to find a way to bring high quality pre-rolls to the market as fast as we can within the parameters of Health Canada. The water roll really supports these activities by being a world-class piece of equipment, uh, stainless steel manufacturing, it all is clean, wipeable, non-porous surfaces, which supports our requirements for Health Canada and gives us the availability to work between anywhere from one to eight channels in order to produce pre-rolls at the specs that we need. Uh, we have multiple different types of tooling so that we can bring different sizes to the market. So pretty much we start off with our first station where we see our team loading the magazines. The cones get loaded there. Um, it goes up to eight channels. 
After the cones are loaded into the magazine, they come down to station one where they are placed into the cone blocks and then have the air injected into them to open up the cone tips. As it moves to the next station, we get to where our filling is. So this is our most crucial station where you can fill up to eight cups at one time. Um, you can have the variability of picking how many compactions you want to pick due to the density of your pre-roll of the material, input material that comes in. Um, so here's where we can dose. We can dose up to 0.35, up to two grams is what we've been going in-house. Um, you get up to about 60 joints per minute on eight channels running consistently with a nice product. Um, after we come from the dosing station where we can control the amount going in, it goes to our compact station so you can choose how much you need to compact the joint. After the compaction station, it goes to where it twists. So it'll get a nice twist on the pre-roll where you see uh, you can find floppy pre-rolls or not, but the water roll does a great job of holding the pre-roll in place and twisting the top, so you get a nice consistent top to move into the cutting station. So once it moves to the cutting station, it cuts off the tops of the joints to the desired like width length you would like. Um, to where the pre-rolls pop off on the back end, to where we have our quality running a quick check on the back end. We've been uh, producing on this water roll for like about a year and a half now, and uh, we're hitting highs of 65 pre-rolls a minute. Our average is 60 to 65, which equals out to about 4,000 pre-rolls an hour. So the consistency and the quality that comes off of the water roll has let us triple to like quadruple our production and hit the, these massive numbers. With the Health Canada requirements and regulatory bodies to make sure we're bringing the highest quality, best products to consumers. It's very important to understand that these are all the same weight, all the same compaction, and meet all those requirements to move to customers. It's not just about the quantity and speed, it's about the quality. We've been working through as one of the top 10 cannabis companies in Canada, and we know that we're only making our way to the top of that list with the right partners to come together with the right equipment. The sky's the limit and we're still keeping an eye on and making our movements in the international markets. Waypack has been a wonderful provider and we're very excited for what the future looks like to take us to the next level.